One of the biggest complaints FPV racers have with HD Zero is the size of the video transmitter. But they also complain that you can't power them by 5 volts like most analog alternatives. This has seen racers choose the Whoop Lite VTX because of its smaller size and ability to be run from any 5 volt pad instead of the dedicated Race 2, even though it can't be mounted to the stack. To solve these specific problems, HD Zero have released a new video transmitter that can be powered by any 5 volt pad or HD connector up to 12 volts. It's 22% smaller than a Race 2 VTX and is also 5% lighter, but it has a 60% thicker PCB than the Whoop Lite VTX, making it more durable while only being one gram heavier. This new VTX can also handle all the different resolutions that HD0 has to offer. 540p at 90 frames per second, the usual 720p at 60 fps, and of course the new 1080p at 30 frames per second for high resolution. And you're probably wondering what it is. Well, this is the brand new HD Zero Race 3 VTX, specifically designed with races in mind. Let's go and put the Race 3 next to the Race 2. On this existing build, we can see we've got the Race 2 VTX. And if we just pop this over the top, we can just see how much smaller that is in terms of footprint that is a lot smaller. With the Race 3 VTX, you can power it from a minimum of four volts. So ideally, if you've got a five volt pad, it's going to work just fine. And you can run it all the way up to 12 volts. So most flight controllers these days are coming out with HD plugs, which can go straight into a HD flight controller. So let's go and just remove this back and remove this and get it all wired up so we can just see how it goes. Look at the size difference between the two. That's going to that's going to be a lot better on our build. You know that is a lot cleaner and a lot smaller than before. It is a vast improvement in certainly in terms of size, wiring complexity. Now that that's all connected up, ready to rock and roll. All we need to do is pop out and give it a test. You see all the people doing hand launches where they basically have it in angle mode. So let's try a hand launch where it's in Accra. Maybe with a smaller VTX instead of that large chunky one, it may convince you to switch to HD Zero for racing. If you're interested in what the goggles are like, watch this video here to find out. I'm Darren Allen. Until next time, don't forget to send it.